To start with, I am not sure if I should call this video a mini documentary, a review, or if it's just me completely rebuilding the park or an area of the park. But keep watching to find out what I'm talking about. Anyway, here we go. This is Yukebox at Lisebay. Yukebox has been in the park since 1993, but in 2012 a new one was bought and that is the one standing at Lisebay today. This year, 10 year birthday, next year, 30 year birthday. Think about that. In 1993, the jukebox opened with a classical design and theming made by Lisebay. The ride was built by Wieland Schwarzkopf after Lisebay's drawings. You are seated in old cars like Cadillacs and Chevys. The centerpiece of the ride was of course a massive jukebox, and the music that was playing was in line with the style of the ride. You could hear artists like Chuck Berry, Elvis Presley, Roy Orbison and many more that would be suited for a jukebox. The theming around the ride was really, really cool, and it featured an old American Shell gas station from the 50s which also had my favorite couch of the park. The back of a car turned into a couch. The back of a car turned into a couch. Brilliant. The ride also had a big board with the artists and songs. Next to the songs, there was a number with a neon frame. At the start of the ride, the board started to scroll through the numbers until it stopped at a number that represented the song that you were going to listen to on your ride. This version of the jukebox is something that I miss so much every time that I visit the park. I love that we still have the jukebox in the park, but I do not agree with the new theming. Okay, the ride itself looks better, but the overall theming is not that on point as it was before. I want the music board back. I want the gas station. And believe me when I say there is plenty more than me that miss the old theming. If anyone from Lisebay is watching this video, we have a small, little, tiny wish for you. Retheme Jukebox to the old concept because it really worked. And now you ask, what is the real difference from the old one to the new one. When the new jukebox was set up in the park, the theming changed with it. By the way, the ride is now built by Gerstlauer and is a model called Polyp 25 that is the biggest model of this ride. Lisebay took down the walls surrounding the ride, they removed the gas station, my couch, the music board and changed the music. In my opinion, Lisebay removed the best part of the ride. The attraction is good, but the theming made it great. I understand the aim that Lisebay went for with the new jukebox. Refresh the area, put in a new version of a popular ride, make the area more green and open by removing walls. But sadly, it just feels like an oddly placed ride in the park. Give us more neon lights, 50s music, Cadillacs, old gas stations, cool music board with some awesome effects and a few couches. Yes, I said a few because we need plenty of them. Now when I come to think about it, why not build a really nice old time diner? where you serve burgers, good ones please, milkshakes, drinks and have a great view over the youth box ride. You will still sit in car style couches, listen to youth box music and maybe an outdoor serving close to the ride. A real youth box has decoration and also the staff should wear old style diner clothes. The thing is, I do have the perfect spot for you take down the old Cristal Salon. 
not sure anyone missed it during 2021, when it wasn't open anyway. It would be a great use of space. We need some more restaurants in the park. In the walkway you could paint traffic lines and put up some old style traffic lights and so on. The game where you can win teddy bears on the opposite side of the box could be transformed to a game where you could win, for example, old style metal signs, decoration, vinyl frames and more. Let's call the area Neon Street. The diner, Kanes Diner, Kanen Kenina, yeah, you get it. And the game could be Shake, Rattle and Roll. And these serve real cola in the diner. And when I say that, I mean Coca-Cola. Because if you serve Pepsi-Cola, I will pay with Monopoly money. I promise that this was not my original intention with this video. My idea was to express what I think about Jukebox and how much I miss the old theming. But things happen when writing it, so here we are. This would be my honest wish for this area of the park, with another ride or two also, of course. I do have some ideas for that, so Lisabai, let me know if you want me to hook you up. And um, by the way, this is my wishes, not something that Lisabai is planning to do. Or are they? No, those side, I have no idea. But if you're watching, uh, this is some good ideas, and please feel free to use them. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please press the like button and leave a comment of what you think in the comment section below. And then you can press this video, because it's also probably kinda good.